Have you ever felt like you were caught in a relentless tug of war between your need for control and the unpredictable nature of life? Picture this, you meticulously plan every detail of a project, only to have unexpected obstacles throw you off course. It's frustrating, isn't it? As someone who loves to take action, it's agonizing to stand on the sidelines, unable to take charge in the face of uncontrollable circumstances. Well, if you're a self-proclaimed control freak too, then you know the struggle all too well. In this video, we dive into the depth of the control freak struggle, unlocking the art of letting go and showing you how to harness strength from surrender. Hey there, welcome to the FlowLab channel, where we discuss mental fitness, psychology and flow states. My name is Jonas and I'm co-founder at FlowLab. Imagine you're an ambitious entrepreneur driven by passion and a relentless pursuit of perfection. Your entire studies you dreamt of your own startup, so you meticulously planned every step of your business venture. The next five years leave no room for uncertainty, so you thought, but then a financial crisis, a pandemic or something else strikes. Your potential investors decide to play safe and withdraw their offers. And suddenly your carefully crafted business strategy crumbles, leaving you feeling utterly powerless in the face of uncontrollable forces. You usually believe that you are in the driver's seat and can create your own luck. Only now you realize that your need to take action clashes with the reality that these circumstances are beyond your control. The emotional turmoil that arises when external forces challenge your need for control can be overwhelming. It's a conflict between our deep desire to take charge and the helplessness we experience when circumstances refuse to bend to our will. If you've ever found yourself trapped in this disheartening battle between your drive for action and the helplessness of external circumstances, then this video is for you. Join us as we delve into the art of letting go, empowering you to navigate the uncontrolled with resilience. Especially in the self-improvement realm, people, us included, preach to strengthen self-efficacy. The belief that you have what it takes to reach your goals. And this can be incredibly empowering. You tackle your obstacles head on, you get things done and you thrive on ambitious challenges. You focus on finding a solution rather than getting overly frustrated about the problem. And in many cases that's the best you can do. Sometimes however, this very approach that usually makes you move forward can become the obstacle that makes you get stuck. Especially people who usually like to take action may struggle with inaction when circumstances force them to. Letting go of an idea, a plan, a problem with no solution can be a heart-wrenching struggle for people with a high need for control. Here are a few impulses that may help you loosen your grip and cope with situations that are outside your control. Let me start with the most obvious tip. Accept the situation. Now I know what you might be thinking. Yeah, thanks genius. That's just not that easy. You're absolutely right. Acceptance is not an easy feat. However, it can begin with something as simple as recognizing the inner resistance you may feel towards accepting the situation. By acknowledging this resistance, you open yourself up to a profound realization. There are limits to control and there will always be aspects outside your sphere of influence. Let's take a moment to explore the concept of self-efficacy further. It's not merely about blindly trusting that you achieve your goals. Self-efficacy is also about believing in your ability to flexibly adapt and navigate through unexpected circumstances. It's about understanding that your resilience lies not only in achieving specific outcomes, but also in your capacity to embrace obstacles and make the most out of unplanned situations along the way. Consider the inspiring stories of entrepreneurs, artists and visionaries who have achieved remarkable success by adapting to unexpected circumstances. They have faced uncertainty head-on, explored uncharted territories and discovered hidden gems along their journeys. Take the remarkable story of Sarah Thompson, for example, an accomplished artist who faced a major setback quite early in her career. After years of pouring her heart and soul into a series of paintings, a fire destroyed her entire collection. You can imagine what profound loss this must have been. However, rather than succumbing to despair, Sarah embraced the opportunity for reinvention. She decided to explore new mediums and styles, discovering a talent for sculpting. Sarah not only found a renewed sense of purpose, but also became a renowned sculptor, achieving remarkable success by adapting to the unexpected and tapping into her innate resilience. When we learn to let go of rigid control, we allow ourselves to discover our potential to navigate uncharted waters with confidence. 
Instead of fueling that inner resistance when things don't go according to plan, I encourage you to take a deep breath. Embrace radical acceptance towards the inconvenient circumstances and allow life to unfold. Taking speed off the gas pedal can actually be something that makes us move forward in the end. We often hear the advice to control the controllables, focus on what we can influence. But sometimes what you can control is not a specific action, it can also be an attitude, a mindset shift or a decision to have faith. In the face of uncontrollable situations, and I'm talking about the day-to-day -day struggles here, it can be incredibly empowering to approach them with a sense of humor and a recognition of their inherent absurdity. Life has a way of throwing curveballs our way and sometimes the best response is to laugh at the cosmic joke. By finding the lightness in the midst of chaos, we shift our perspective and release the tension that comes from desperately clinging to control. So the next time you find yourself faced with an unexpected turn of events, try to see the humor in the situation and embrace the absurdity. Apart from that, an approach to become more flexible in your way of thinking and acting can be to purposefully engage in acts of spontaneity. By intentionally seeking out opportunities to break free from rigid routines and embrace the unknown, you exercise your ability to adapt flexibly in the long run. Spontaneity serves as a training ground for dealing with new situations, as it teaches us to think on our feet, make quick decisions and trust in our instincts. So, whether it's trying a new activity, embarking on an impromptu adventure or simply saying yes to an unexpected invitation, allow yourself to embrace the joy of spontaneity. Each spontaneous act becomes a stepping stone towards cultivating resilience and becoming more comfortable with the unpredictable nature of life. So folks, I invite you to trust more in the process and discover the possibilities that await us when we learn to let go and trust in our ability to adapt. And remember, acceptance isn't about resignation or passivity, it's about taking a step back in order to move forward with the current and gracefully adjusting to the circumstances. If you enjoyed watching this video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell so you won't miss any of our future videos. Also download the FlowLab app now and start your 7 day free trial for an individualized training plan with science-based guided meditations. I see you soon, have a great day.